The Democratic field has shrunk to four. Who would have thought that a man whose name you couldn't pronounce until a few months ago from a place where very few people have been as a city in a state that most people on the coast don't care about could suddenly be in the game. His name is Buttigieg. Therefore, anything can happen. Mike Bloomberg looked and said, wait a second, Joe Biden disappearing, Trump likely to get reelected. Maybe I can do something for my country. The progressives are probably not happy. Why? They're going to have to take Michael Bloomberg on. And when you do that, you're going to have millions of dollars of media thrown right back at you because you can afford to do it. But traditionally, parties, whether they be Republicans or Democrats, the people who turn out in primaries tend to be the left and the right, the, the true ideologues. Can Michael Bloomberg get past that is the question. So I've known Michael Bloomberg for a long time. If you go back early on, he had... He said a lot of great things about Trump, but I know Michael, he became just a nothing. He was really a nothing. Uh, he's not gonna do well, but I think he's gonna hurt Biden actually, but he doesn't have the magic to do well. Uh, little Michael will fail. You can call Buttigieg howdy duty. You can call Elizabeth Warren Pocahontas. You can call Joe Biden. Well, what did he call him, little Joe? Who knows, but Mike Bloomberg won't respond to that. He's much more disciplined, he's not a politician, and he'll fight back in the way he knows best, on the air and through his media campaign and through social media. That's what he'll do.